My god, rarity. Little dog tails, like. So let's empty them out. Ah! Today I got quite a bag of ponies. So let's have a look. Help me! So first off, I got a Lily Lightly. I have so many Lily Lightlies now that it's getting kind of ridiculous. So this one is missing its eyelashes and the lights don't work. They're also pretty filthy. They've got a nice plait in the mane though. And yeah, I don't know if you can like customize these or anything. I'm kind of curious. Maybe I could try it. I do love the cutie mark on Lily, on Lily Lightly, by the way. I think it's so gorgeous. And the dress is so lovely too. Next ponies is, is that we've got a lovely little collection of rainbow dashes here. For some reason, these ponies in this bundle are so filthy. And I don't know why. God knows what sort of life they had before they got here. But anyway... So this Rainbow Dash is a very weird one, so I believe they are a fake since they have a black neck plug. They don't, do they have a black, wait, wait, what? I'm confused, they, okay, right, what, whoa, whoa, <laughs> hold up, hold up, hold up. So they're in the old head mold, right? Okay. But they have like the, the new eyes. Does anybody know if there's such thing as a rainbow dash that has these eyes but in the old head mold? Because I thought they had like a different shaped eye in the old head mold, but apparently not. I don't know if this is fake. The cutie mark is messed up. It's it's like terrible. So this is definitely going to be down for customs. But like, yeah, is this a fake pony? I don't want to snap the neck plug. I can't. I don't think they have a black neck plug. So I'm like, are they genuine? I think they're actually genuine, but I don't know. This rainbow dash has got quite an eloquent main cut. So we have like a little bob going on here. So they're meant to be like the, the ribbon rainbow dash. So the person, the previous owner has cut off their ribbon. So yeah, and they give them this little, this little hair cut here. It's quite nicely done, not gonna lie. And we have this rainbow dash, which is an articulated rainbow dash in a very filthy state. So the hair is really frizzy and frizzed up and really monkey. Like it's so disgusting and dirty and everything so yeah Ew. speaking of more articulate ponies we have a cherry lee and a cheese sandwich so this cherry lee has definitely seen better days the hair is just so frizzy and it's just oh no they tied the mane and the tail together i hate when i hate when my people do that <laughs> so yeah ugh. and this cheese sandwich here you're like first you're like oh he looks all right and then you turn him to the side and then he's he's missing a tail <laughs> I wonder if I can make this one into a custom since he's missing a tail. He just needs like a new tail really. So yeah, I wonder if anyone's ever made a custom using a cheese sandwich. Next we have these 2017 movie ponies and my god Rarity. So Rarity is in a right state I don't know where they have been sniffing. But they are definitely very, very filthy. Like where the hell have these ponies been? Do I want to know? I do debate on remaking my OC as one of these figures, but to be honest, I don't think I can be asked with the trauma. I think Fluttershy looks pretty much the best out of both of these figures. Like, look at the little eyes. Like, I think, I don't really think there's much, there's not really a misprint there. There might be a slight one with this one that's going further backward and this one's further forward, which is a bit meh. But, um, yeah, overall, they're not bad. Like, the tail is actually not low down. Like, these little dog tails. Like, for some reason, like, the tails are usually quite low down on these ponies. And that's what I hate about them. Like, the tail should be pretty high up. Like, and this Twilight is quite a thick boy. This seems to be quite a big pony figure. But I think I get that sort of vibe because of the stance they're in. Like, the, the stance they're in. And because they have rather big wings. So, the next three little ponies that I got are these three and i feel like pretty much all of these ponies have seen better days so this sunset shimmer here they have a bit of a main cut i don't know what what's with that what is the point like why what what's the point of trimming that bit and not the other i don't i don't get it like at least i know it's an ugly haircut but like at least get it even and symmetrical like on oh, the tails messed up too like, oh it's fallen out as well it's so dry it's so dry like what 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 have these ponies been through i'm a bit concerned this applejack lush of course i love applejack figures you know me they're in the old head mold they have like the crystal sort of eye there and they are missing a hair plug which is really annoying like the haircut isn't that bad in this pony again it's only one 
like one of these side rootings, <laughs> one of the sides have, have been cut and the other side is a, uh, it's a long and uh, I don't really get it. I don't, I don't get what they're trying to achieve, but okay. And it's twilight, it's just a twilight, aren't they? I mean, they're just a bit monkey and they can do with a good clean and stuff. They have like a little scuff on the neck, I think. Yeah, they have like a little, little random scuff there. So yeah, and they have an elastic in their tail, which is so dry that it's 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 coming off so yeah these ponies have been in a very deserty dry dirty environment which doesn't sound very nice luckily i'm here to rescue them okay so i have another little bundle here which was too small to have a video of its own and it is basically a bag full of pinkie pies so let's empty them out <laughs> so yes i found this mini bundle on ebay of seven pinkie pies so I love Earth Ponies, like they are my go-to race for some reason when I do customs and like characters. I don't know why, I just love doing Earth Pony customs and for some reason I always come up with like Earth Pony customs. I just, I don't know what it is, I just love Earth Ponies and I'm just drawn to them, I don't know why. So can we just take a moment just to admire all of these Pinkie Pies? Like this one has a gradient in its eye. Like, it's not in the old head mold, but they're pretty fine and everything. I'm definitely going to customise them more because the hairline is atrocious. And oh my goodness, look how filthy these ones are too. Are these from the same seller? Like, I'm sure that they're not. I don't think they are, but yeah, they, these are also pretty filthy. Like, I wouldn't be surprised, but I did order them separately, so I don't think so. So this Pinkie Pie is actually one of... It's so filthy. Okay, so this Pinkie Pie is from like a clear bag sort of Pinkie Pie. So you don't really see these much. Um, I never really see these sort of Pinkie Pies much in, in like haul video. In haul, wow. I never really get these in bundles. Like the ones that just have the one singular highlight in the eye. I don't know why. Because I, I just don't, I just don't know why. This one has no eyelashes and they have their mane cut. And it's a pretty good job too. Their tail has also been cut. And the rest are just like, well, Pinkie Pie. And I think this one's actually an authentic, genuine one because they don't have a black neck plug and they're feeling good quality, good condition and everything. So yes, I am so happy that I found this little bundle as well of seven Pinkie Pies. I can't wait to do so many pony customs. Ah! So that is about it for this bundle and I am so happy that I got so many Pinkie Pies and I cannot wait to do so many Earth Pony customs with them. So if you enjoyed this video be free to leave a cheeky little like and a friendly little comment and if you haven't already please subscribe and remember patience, time and effort can make you achieve anything and thank you all so much for watching and bye!